Exercise number five, kettlebell press. Yes, it's very good exercise. Very good exercise. Again, if you uh, do this exercise, keep the uh, kind of distance 90 degree here, so it's more effective. It's okay if you do with four kg, but if you try to do with 10 kgs or even eight kgs and like purple metal kettlebells, it will hurt your wrist. And why are you doing with a kettlebell when it's easier and much comfortable to take the dumbbell? It's more natural than swinging. People do this swing and then yeah, they do sort of back and swing. Why you need this? Ouch, that hurts. And I see people try to swing with this kettlebell with 10 kilos now so if you know what you're doing and you know how to control 10 kg kettlebell yes that's fine but majority of people don't they hurt their wrist because they keep banging their wrist if you know how to control yes see it's controlled but that's 4 kg I wouldn't do this with a 10 because it's hard. Take the dumbbell, it's much easier. Take the dumbbell, don't waste your time and take the dumbbell and do with the proper techniques. Much better than kettlebell. Kettlebell is good for other exercises, but not exercise for number four is squats. Why people do this? Why you keep your bum in? I don't get it. Bum should be out. But that's how people do it. Imagine, okay, if you do it without the weights, maybe it's fine. But imagine if you take 15 kg, by taking 50 kg sandbag and try to bring your bum in, it's not good. It's really not good. Your back will hurt. And your legs is not straight. Your legs is, legs is everywhere. And the whole technique is just wrong. You know what I tell my clients? The best way to learn how to do squats is by imagining if you're in a public toilet. When you're in a public toilet, you don't sit down this way, do you? Or do you? Comment below if you do. Normally, people, by not sitting on a public toilet, Unless if they put the paper, unless if they put the paper, yeah. <laughs> so they do this. So your bum out. And think like this, every time you do squats, keep your bum out. <laughs> no in, don't do that in stuff. <laughs> I'll show you the correct way doing squats. That is correct way. So your toes, your feet should point straight not there here inside out N none of those correct way this way it's easier much easier and you can put weights it will be much easier good for your back too do correct way bam out bam your feet should point straight don't do none of those and all this kind of that's not the right way Number three, cable pull through. I don't get this exercise. I honestly don't get it. And I tried it over and over with right techniques. It doesn't engage your glutes as much uh, as if you do barbell thrust or lunges. It's a, it doesn't work, but people love doing it. I don't know why people love doing it. To be honest, okay. Again, this is 30 kilos, and if you put a little bit more, it's already pressure on a bag by taking these weights in this position. So, this exercise, and I see people do that, they don't even pull, so this is the right way, but my arms, my quads working more than my glutes. 
So this exercise is supposed to be for your glutes. It doesn't work like this. And plus the rope between my legs. We should have balls. We should have balls. <laughs> it must be painful if you <laughs> I'm glad I don't but yeah so but if you try to keep away from your middle section it's even harder if you put more weight so I don't see the effectiveness of this exercise it's kind of dangerous not comfortable I don't I don't understand this exercise if you do comment below how many times a week do you do this sort of exercise because I don't get it so honestly. Exercise number two is lunges. That's how I see people do lunges. That's how I see people do lunges. Or another way people do sort of this. Don't get it. So both of them is warm and by keeping your legs like tucked in like this sort of way you work your quads and a little bit of hamstrings a little bit of glutes but you not engage your lower body as much if you do for instance wider lunges and keep your back uh, your body back not forward back this way you engage 100% quartz hamstrings glutes that's perfect this way and by leaning forwards your back will hurt so this is not the right way this way again this way it's the best and the only way you should do lunges comment below how you do lunges and how many reps and sets do you do per workout or per week or per month so number know. one is dumbbell donkey kick it's very popular exercise but i don't get it i honestly don't understand plus it can be very dangerous so here how you do it so you put the dumbbell there first of all it's very painful and when you try to lift and if you drop this dumbbell it will be painful <laughs> so what they do don't care kick so you try to lift the dumbbell so it's six kilos it's not heavy for me i'm just worried to not drop it it's not comfortable it's not stable it's painful it's that's six kilos but imagine if you do, whoa, if you put, uh, I don't know, 12 kilos or 10 kilos dumbbell. Comment below why you do this exercise, if you do, because I don't understand. I know that you're trying to engage your hamstrings, but there are other exercises that you can engage your hamstrings by doing um, something more comfortable. Yeah, so. Dear, dear, why people make these exercises? Okay, I try to lift slowly so I will not drop the... You know, it's easy to drop this dumbbell and because it's wobbles, it's really wobbles. Unless you do it really slowly, you might get the benefit, but no. No, now the gym's open and you can use the machine for your hamstrings. So, that's it for the video. I hope you like this video. If you have any questions, ideas for future videos, please let me know by commenting below. If you are new to my channel, welcome to Simply Feed London. I always post videos about exercise, uh, nutrition, uh, supplements, and I will always motivate you. And I want to say massive thank you for my existing subscribers. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. I hope each video is not disappointing you. Thank you for watching my videos and I hope you like my videos. If you have any questions, 
please comment below or email me on the email you see on your screen. Look after yourself, look after your health. Your health is your wealth. And I will see you very, very soon, probably in two days. Bye.